is your tour of Hideaway Beach. Perfect day, Coco K. We're starting over here at On The Rocks Bar with live music. They have TVs, they have a billiards table, really cool places to sit if you want to listen to live music. They got billiards and a nice view of the ship. So that is the On The Rocks Bar. And next we're going to take you down over to the rest of the... leaving the live music and we are going towards the first of the food areas the snack shack it's called the hideaway hut there's restrooms right here plenty of loungers it's a small lagoon not very much to swim in it's just kind of a real small sandy bottom Here is your hideaway hut. The three new options not available anywhere else at Coco K. You have the ceviche, which is local fish. Caribbean coconut shrimp basket and crispy island fish sandwich. That's your menu. Right. One of your several bars there are places to sit here's your beverage station toppings for your hamburgers there is just your standard bar another beverage station condiment station all right and here we go with the big pool Looks to be about as big as the Island Oasis Lagoon. Your DJ section is in the front. The water is definitely heated. Let's check. Not bad, not bad. And there's the DJ pumping out some trance. swim up bar everyone here today is employees or media social media and their families uh, employees Feeling of the Ibiza vibes here. All right. So here's the, at the bar. Pretty loud. So these are all first come first serve. The beach beds are all first come first serve. It's one big pool, all heated. Yeah. All right, continuing on over here, we're gonna go look at some pizza. 
Let's check it out here. This is the pizza place. There's more restrooms over here. Here you see drink station. You can shower off your feet. They have a few hammocks here, but you see it's loaded with lots of loungers and umbrellas. And over here, it's called a slice of paradise. Look at that. Pretty cool. And everyone wants to try the pizza. Everyone wants to try the pizza. Look at that. Beautiful. What kind of pizza is this? What? Bahamian seafood. What is this? What? Barbecue chicken, pepperoni, and cheese. All right. Bahamian seafood. Does that mean there's conch? So there is your menu. Island guava barbecue sauce. Potato twist with grilled chicken. So they got a barbecue chicken. The seafood has shrimp, snapper, and peppers and onions. And they have empanadas, as you can see there. We have another window here, as you can see. Two windows ordering. And then I guess they bring it to your table. Or if you just have a slice or two, they just give it to you. And sounds like the DJ is piped in all the way over here. So you can't escape the DJ. So I may have to turn the sound off. So you can grab your pizza and you can just sit here and enjoy the view. And now I'm going to take you to a little peek at the expensive cabanas with their own infinity pool. Okay, here is just a peek at one of the Royal Social. I've got tons of Royal Caribbean social media. But this is a look at your cabanas, your infinity pool cabanas. It's similar to what you would pay for an over-the-water cabana over at South Beach. And let's just take a look at another one real quick. Jason Liberty Party. Hey. All right. How are you? Really good, thanks. You've been back on the Flow Rider? Sorry? You've been back on the Flow Rider? Um, I haven't been since, no. I went yeah. yesterday. I didn't go today. Was it busy? No. It was me and the old guy, and that was yeah. it. You guys are good, though. Oh, thanks. Those are really good. I just posted some on my YouTube. What's your YouTube? I'll check it out at some point. All right. I'm going to take some more video here showing you the lagoon. It's just a little small lagoon. It's a little chilly today. It's about 72, but it's breezy. And you can see they have some palapas over here. I guess if the tide comes up a little, you know, you have some freeboard there, but you cannot go near those rocks. The DJ piping music from, from way over there. They're piping it all the way over to the slice of paradise pizza. Can't really get away from it. Out here, it's not quite as bad, but you can hear it off in the distance. There's the expensive cabanas over there with their own little infinity pool and the main pool over there is also heated so let's go back over there and check out the action all right we're making our way back over towards the hideaway hut also known as snack shack and you can see people in the infinity pool all hanging over the edge they're almost in a place here where you have the bar 
where you're mixing two music. You got the DJ pumping and the speakers up here. And then off in the distance, the live band. And here is the snack shack, basically, your hideaway hut. There's three new menu options here available, not in the general area. This one, you have the ceviche. I've already mentioned that before. Crispy on fish sandwich. I'm going to try those. So I think you've seen it all. Hideaway Beach. And I'll leave you with my final commentary. We'll go check out the DJ one more time. I'll get some food. I'll show you the, the food. And then I'll give you my final commentary. This guy's really pumping out some trance music. Good stuff. It's adult oriented. No lollipop and bubble gum. Crappy music. No Cupid shuffle. No cha cha shuffle. None of that bullshit. It's adults only area. And the water is not bad, not bad at all. And there's your swim up bar. I think he's just playing a, uh, he's playing a track right now. He's taking a break, I think. And that's what he's doing. So you get the idea. So you get the idea. He's playing a track right now. He's on a break, but definitely adult oriented music 18 to 25 house trance club mix party vibe non-stop All right, I'm going to give you my final review of the Hideaway Beach Club. As you can hear, it is non-stop, party vibe. This is adult-oriented. You're not going to hear the Miley Cyrus and Michael Jackson and hip-hop. You're going to hear trance, house, club mix, more geared for adults, non-stop party. The pools are heated, the DJ runs non-stop, the beats just continue. So if you don't like loud music, then probably not the place for you. Um, plenty of bars, plenty of really nice seating areas. There are cabanas, and you can't escape the music. You're going to hear that all the way across the island. I tried some of the food options, and they're, I mean, you know, they're okay. Nothing, nothing to write home about. Definitely not worth paying to come here just for extra food. The pizza's as good as Sorrento's. They have empanadas, they're not that great. Um, had a fish sandwich, it was like a McDonald's filet fish And that's not saying it was bad, it was good. I would get it again. Nice alternative. I had the ceviche. I'm not a shrimp person, so I didn't get the coconut shrimp. Uh, the ceviche was good, nice and spicy. And overall, I mean, it's a fun time. 
for me personally, I wouldn't pay to come here you know, more than like thirty-five dollars. And since I come all the time to Coco Cay, I'll probably come like one more time, and probably won't come unless it's like thirty dollars, and I have friends that want to come and hang out with them. But other than that, it's, it's not really worth paying a lot of money for. You pretty much get a lot of the same thing at Island Oasis. Here, there is more, I guess, comfortable seating under under cover. So you have the On the Rocks bar, which is actually really nice. Probably the best views on the whole area. You got nice, comfortable seats, and you have the overlook. You do have music there too with a band. So, but that is a pretty nice place over there. It's a little less crazy than over here at the main area. So I definitely would say go to the On The Rocks bar. And overall, you know, I'm glad they're charging. The capacity here is about 2,000 people. So they're making some good money. Drink packages work here. Crown and Anchor vouchers work here. And overall, everyone has a price. For me, I would say, you know, 30 bucks. Really, all you're getting is comfortable seating. So that's it. I hope you liked my video. I tried to show you the vibe of it and the feel of what it's like. And um, one advice I could give you is the more you drink, the better the music sounds and the more fun you'll have here. So thanks for watching, everyone. Peace out.